As a designer, I've spent billions of hours figuring out what my portfolio should look like. What font should I use? Light mode or dark mode? In countless hours on the exact shade of blue my button should be. That's why I made this. This is a minimum viable portfolio powered by Notion. It's designed to focus on content first, AKA your case studies. But Notion also doubles down as a project management system, a job tracker, and a place to store all your Batman quotes. I'm vengeance. In this video, I'm gonna teach you exactly how to use this template and build the best case studies possible, even if you're just a baby. I'm just a baby. You might be asking, will using a Notion portfolio actually get me hired? Well, meet Sade. Her first portfolio was made on Notion and it actually helped her land her first freelance job and even got her interview at Google. And Tanner says, as a hiring manager, I would much prefer a plain portfolio where the work spotlights who you are and what you can do as a designer over the portfolio itself. First, go to the video linked in the description and then duplicate it right here. This is the homepage. You can replace this image of Batman with an image of you. Then change this headline to your name and your tagline should highlight your niche or specialty. Something like product designer building the next generation of AI software or product designer specializing in design systems or product designer focused on stopping the Joker. Why so serious? These are gonna be your main links, which you can change like this. Next, you'll see a simple collection of case studies, which brings us to case studies. When I first started as a designer, I had no idea how to create case studies, which is why I made this, a free case study resource directly on the template. It'll include things like Qfolios, a collection of portfolio websites from real people who've worked at Apple, Google, Microsoft, and other top tech companies. You can check out their case studies to get a good idea of what your case study should include. Now, going back to the template, it'll also include case study tutorials from other designers as well. Oh, and if you need help designing mockups and images for your case studies, I got you covered too. I've included free Figma templates for mockups and user flows. I know, I'm awesome. I'm Batman. Next, I've included an example of a real case study by a designer who works at Apple. Her name is Hannah and her case study is amazing. This example shows just how much you can customize on Notion. You can shrink and expand images, create multiple columns of text, and embed videos of your prototype. But if you need something more simple, I got you covered too. I've created a simple case study template where all you have to do is replace content. For example, you can replace this image and thumbnail by clicking here, then clicking replace image. Now, you might still be wondering, I'm just a baby. I don't have any experience or client projects. What case studies can I create? One idea is that you can redesign a popular tool. I chose to redesign ChatGPT. I noticed the chat experience was kind of weird. When I think about sending a message on a chat, I think of iMessage or Instagram, but it's also a common design pattern across various apps. So I've redesigned it to be more familiar and usable, applying Jacob's law, AKA the law of familiarity. Speaking of AI, Notion just launched Notion AI, which leverages all the content, projects, and resources you've created on Notion, which sounds like a cheat code to productivity. You can even ask it if I have no experience, what UX case studies could I create, which sounds like a cheat code to becoming a UX designer. If you want to support the channel, consider buying a Notion plan. Because Notion sponsored this video, I was able to create this portfolio template at no cost to you. So what happens after you finish your Notion portfolio? How do you exactly share it with recruiters? Well, Notion allows you to share and publish any Notion page you create, which is awesome. However, it creates a super long link that may not be job friendly. So you can use a tool like simple.inc that integrates with Notion and helps you use a custom domain name. All this portfolio talk is cool and all, but how does one exactly become a UX designer as fast as possible? Well, I answer that exact question right here.